So in terms of our mouse, and so the problem with SARS-2 is it doesn't grow in a mouse, can't use the mouse ACE2 receptor. Um, it's pretty easy to model at least four or five different mutation sets that you could put into the receptor binding domain of SARS-2 so that it can use the mouse ACE2 receptors, one of which we knew uh, interacted with a specific residue that was variant in between mouse and human ACE2 molecules. And the other residue was a proline right next to it. We just didn't like the idea of a proline next to it, so we changed it because, well, we could, and so we did. <laughs> it's a general rule. If there's a proline there, I just don't like it. I don't know why I don't like it, but I gotta move it. It's and the best use of a gain of function thinking process I've ever heard. It's all good. It's all good. Do, do you see any difference between male and female mice? <laughs>